friends welcome to my youtube channel hopefully all of my friends will be my friends after a long time i am making this video for you guys and uh, actually i came here for uh, one of my project uh, inspection uh, the, actually this is the big boundary wall and uh, i came here for the inspection of shuttering and uh, reinforcement steel no sorry re uh, reinforcement of the footing and uh, prior to concrete we are checking this and uh, i will show you just the points are here actually first of all i will uh, just short debrief about the footing this is the strip footing and l l type footing uh, as per the property line and coordinate points and uh, you can see uh, this is l shape l shape strip footing according to the design and the actually they are doing this footing uh, in two parts lower part concrete and then they are doing the ground beam as well the size of the footing is uh, the lower part is uh, 600 into 20 the mean the 600 is width and uh, 20 cm is the depth which i will show you here you can see the width of the footing is 60 60 cm 600 mm and depth of the footing is 20 you can see here this is very congested place okay friends and uh, then this is the beam this beam after the footing concrete the height of the beam will be 60 I mean th that lower part 20 and this beam 60 cm total is 80 cm i will show you see here you can see in the tape this is 80 cm I mean 20 cm plus 60 cm is 80 Now I will just short debrief about that reinforcement. The lower part, in the long, uh, in the lengthwise, mean the long span, the top and bottom steel of the footing is 12 mm, 150 center to center. I will just show you here. See, this is because I am alone here. That's why it's very difficult to brief. See, you can see here, 50 centi. then 30 cm and then 450 uh, the 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 die of steel is 12 mm top and bottom and uh, this is top this is bottom it's going lengthwise 150 the bottom concrete cover here you can see is um, 50 here you can see the longitudinal bar of the footing is total number is 8 you can see here this is the inspection request i already inspected but uh, just i am making this video for you peoples this is you can see 12 mm 1 2 3 and 4 mean 1 2 3 and 4 total 8 uh, steel in top and bottom 4 in top and 4 uh, in bottom actually you can see the side cover as well See, they provided five centi cover in the side. See, you can see this is the concrete cover between uh, concrete and steel spacing. Here, that that also you can see that is also five centi. Then this beam steel, I will just shortly brief about the beam steel here. The rings, I mean the stirrups, are same like that, fifty centi. here you can see 50 cm and then 30 cm 50 into 30 then 450 mean each ring uh, mean center to center is 150 150 mm mean 15 cm and the longitudinal bar of the beam according to the drawing this is 1 2 3 4 4 both side mean outside and inside total is 8 as per drawing the die of the bars are 12 mm and ring is also 12 mm the hook hook you can you can see the hook is 8 cm according to the 10d or 9d and the width of the uh, beam I mean the ground beam is 200 mm after the deduction of concrete cover the width is coming 100 then this is the big column this is uh, here the infill block will come on top of this and uh, they tied it very well here you can see the bending wire they 
this is this is called cross tie and uh, uh, cross uh, cross tie eight uh, figure eight tie something like that this is fine now we will proceed more there is small columns you can see the, because this is the boundary wall and uh, here is the chain link is coming on top of this that's why here is the, co uh, the column 20 into 20 I mean 20 cent into 20 cent 200 mm to 200 mm actually here uh, they are they, they have prepared this footing for the concrete first of all they will do the lower part that lower part they will do the concrete in partial I will show show you partial they have done the concrete for the lower part I will show you they are cleaning as well here you can out uh, you can see outside there is the blinding concrete this is uh, PCC concrete below the footing with the 15 centi offset this is 15 mm blinding concrete you can see actually this is not first of all they did that uh, ground improvement the shuttering quality is very nice new shuttering they have used the work the workmanship is very nice here is the chamfer here yes here you can see that uh, PCC the level differences as well here you can see this see that uh, 50 centi almost 70 uh, 7 centi or not 50 centi 50 mm sorry this is 70 mm according to the level they adjusted and uh, here you can see they are they they have done that um, bitumen paint and uh, polythene sheet as well they are cleaning as well okay okay they are cleaning also this is these are the chamfer columns the work is very nice here now i will show you that the lower part that uh, they have done it the partial area just a bit yes here you can see this uh, they have done that lower part here they need to to uh, do here they they will do the concrete in the lower part and that side because here the expansion joint is coming every 20 meters they are giving the expansion joint i think so see here you can see that lower part of the footing is 20 centi see this is 20 centi and uh, now they are doing the ground beam shuttering is done steel already they put here and the conductings and then they will do the concrete as well very long boundary wall this is and uh, very good work here now they are planning for the ground beam concrete after the concreting uh, so that conducting approval and this side that they are preparing the shuttering for that uh, lower part of the concrete hopefully friends See, this is the big column, one meter column. Here is infill concrete after the block work. Now I will show you the block work as well. That side, you will cut the point. After this beam, in mean this ground beam, they will do the block work as per given design by the consultant. Actually, uh, friends, this is a very big boundary wall, and I am going to another part where they have done that block work for the completed footing concrete After yes friends I reached here because this is very far I came through car and uh, here you can see the block work same the, the lower part they have done it here and now they prepared this ground beam which I have briefed uh, I think a few minutes ago uh, after the concrete they have done this see they have applied this bitumen paint here uh, for the waterproofing purpose then they applied this uh, polythene sheet I mean both part lower part and upper part of the concrete after the two coat of bitumen paint now they are doing the block work this is one meter column according to the uh, here this one meter column width is 30 centi this is 20 centi above the beam they are uh, doing block work but below the block work they are doing this uh, damp proof course as well here you can see this is damp proof course and they are doing the block work here now the work is very beautiful 
small columns where the chain link where chain link hinges and that plates base plates and these things will be connected with the RCC column can see here they will plaster it as well here the light is coming the conducting for ELV and electrical points they they have done two uh, two panels for the sample and uh, here you can see the ground beam as well and the boundary wall is starting from that side here you can see they are doing the block work and they buried it the footing is going to buried ok friends hopefully this video is very useful for all of you if there is any comments you can ask and uh, please uh, uh, see my all videos and uh, like share and comment and share with your friends thank you bye bye Allah Hafiz